Hi crafty friends, I'm Sylvia. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Okay, so today we will be uh, kitting up the siren by Mandy Manzano. She is, um, I, well, I used to write down the start date, which is March 1st, and she's diamond shape is round, and she's 21.7 by 28.7 inches, and which is 55 centimeters by 73 centimeters. And there are, I believe, 33 colors. Yes, 33 colors and two ABs. Okay, so we will be using uh, the Arbor Freight containers. Uh, we'll be using two because there's 24 small containers and it's 33 colors so we're going to be using two. Okay, so let's see. Let's, I think the best way is probably just to take all the containers out of the, sto of the uh, storage container. <laughs> That's funny. Storage container. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, um, so let's just put them here on the side. Okay. Let's put that aside. And we're going to start with the first one. And this one is an AB. And it's 138. It's a very pretty blue. Okay. And then I'm going to get my scissors, snip, and pour them in the container. Make sure that you get them all in there. It's not too many of these ABs. Okay, look how beautiful that is. All right, and then we're gonna get the sticker. And we're gonna label, label the container so that we know when we're working on the uh, painting. Okay, and then we're gonna do this obviously uh, 33 times. Um, this one is also an AB and it's a 141. And it's a very pretty white AB. Okay, um, I'm going to be working on this painting for the hashtag Mermaids and Magic 2022. Um, it's hosted by Shay from Crafting with Shay and Randy from You Can Call Me Butter or Shay and Randy Productions. For the month of March. Um, I think this mermaid painting is absolutely beautiful. I had bought it a while back. Um, so I decided to use, I, I was actually going crazy. I had a couple of mermaid paintings and I was trying to figure out which one to use for this event. But I kept going back to this one. I just, just love the colors. You know, you guys know that I love all blues and greens. So I kept going back to that mermaid. Um, but, you know, she only has two ABs. So I'm thinking that I am going to definitely bling her out. Well, I'm going to attempt. Um, probably add some uh, 310 ABs on her hair. Uh, and also maybe some ABs on her on her scales in... in uh, I'm not sure yet, ABs or sparklers on her tail. So her tail can look super sparkly. Um, and I'm thinking also there's another event going on starting on March 1st. Um, it's called Sparklers Gone Wild. So it starts on March 1st. It's um, by DP with Sparklers, Tina. And she's awesome. And it basically I think that you can work on any painting and uh, it's just basically um, adding some bling to it, enhancing your painting. Um, and of course, uh, I think you have to get the, uh, the stuff from uh, DP with sparklers. So it's just perfect. I'm working on the mermaid. I need to enhance her and so I can join that event. So it's called Sparklers Gone Wild. It's on Facebook. Uh, let's see. Oh. I am actually uh, still working on heart butterflies, and that was for the Love is in the Air and Palantine. 
and I believe it's already over uh, probably over Monday because it's the 28th but I have a very little left on the um, on heart butterflies and I'm still working on the Leviathan, the Leviathan which is this beautiful uh, diamond art club a dragon uh, I got it from my daughter and I try to finish it but then I start I join another event and so then I put the poor dragon aside and the poor dragon is crying just waiting but I will finish it guys I just don't know when one of these days it was so funny because when I went to the retreat um, I had it on the table while I was working on the other painting that uh, Sandra sweet Sandra West uh, gifted me and so everybody kept asking me so how long have you been working on the <laughs> and the leviathan and i said oh my gosh a long time i exaggerated i said over a year but it's not over a year i actually looked up in the lock book and um i actually started on the beginning of december so it hasn't been that far i mean that long but i mean and they were like oh you don't diamond paint every day no i i, I wish but i can't um you know i gotta take care of my mom and i just gotta do other things that i'm also into scrapbooking so that. I think if I if I diamond paint it every day then maybe I if I'll attempt if I actually attempt to diamond paint every day maybe I can finish the Leviathan but that's something uh, yeah so I will link all this information um, on the description box okay guys let's see what else let's see on Saturday I went to see Olivia my niece at her school she uh, She's in a, uh, a program called, it's actually an extracurricular program called Destination Imagination here in Texas. I don't know. I guess, I guess it's in every state. I'm not sure. But it's a national group. And they've been, they have been working, I think, for a couple of months, maybe five to six months. And I think it's like six of them in the group. And there, it's like a little play that they perform. And uh, parents and uh, guests are invited. And it was on the Saturday. And... So they played, they had like this little performance and they were just adorable. And it was about, the topic was about bullying. And uh, I thought Olivia was great. I think Olivia should definitely take some drama classes when she goes to middle school. Um, the, it was a team effort, so it was just great. Um, so then basically, so they do this and then they have to go and do, the, they, they give them a challenge, but it's a secret challenge. So we, we, don't, we don't get to see what it was, but then, you know, you go home and then they got scored. And then, um, and so what happens, my sister and Olivia, they called me, I think they called me Saturday night or sun, on Sunday to say, hey, they did so well that they're going to state. So they're going to compete basically with other groups in other districts, which is just, that's great. I mean... It's an extracurricular and um, it keeps them busy. Um, and it's supposed to help like, with, uh, you know, the children uh, if they're creative, you know? So, and Olivia likes that, Olivia likes art. Okay, what else? Uh, and then on Monday, my daughter came over. Um, we went out to lunch, lunch and she decided that she wanted to go have some Greek, Greek. So we went to this wonderful Greek restaurant and um, I always tend to have the same thing. <laughs> I think we all do. Um, their potatoes are absolutely, the Greek potatoes are absolutely delicious. But I have something that you guys might go say it's yucky, but I absolutely love it. Um, when I lived in Spain for a while, this is what I used to have all the time is octopus. <laughs> yes, I, I said octopus um, and with pita. And it's absolutely delicious. Yeah. A lot of people don't like octopus, but I like it. Um, what else? And what's going on, guys, here in Texas with the weather? I mean, the other day it was like high 80. And then the next day it was like 20, in the 20s. It's like we had freezing uh, rain and then the schools were closed. And, um, you know just crazy you can't really drive in the ice it's dangerous so everything basically just closes down and what else um i am looking forward to my daughter's birthday yay it's this weekend um it's her birthday so i already ordered the cake 
Um, so I picked it up actually today. My husband and I, we picked up the cake. She's coming over tomorrow. So is the family. We're going to have a dinner and celebrate her birthday. Um, she, you know, I had mentioned before, my daughter loves cars, always has. And um, so she's working for a great company uh, uh, for cars. And so we basically made the cake. I wanted to do the, the shape of a, the car, the cake, but I didn't do that. So we basically, it's round, but it's, it's designs like for, it's actually gonna have a car on top of it. It's gonna be her car. So yeah, so I think she's gonna love it. And it's her favorite um, flavor, which is um, velvet. Velvet, is it velvet cake? Yeah, velvet cake. So yeah, so she's gonna be happy and we're gonna make her some, actually she wants grandma to make her um, empanadas de pollo. So it's basically, um, chicken breast, breaded chicken breast with pasta. So I'll have to call my sister to see if she bring, if she can bring a dish. Um, of course, some salad and some bread. So yeah, looking forward to that. Got the candles. I really wanted to get her the, the, you know, those long candles that sparkle. Couldn't find those, but it's okay. Um, we're just very, very proud of, of our daughter and we feel blessed. She's beautiful, she's strong, she's confident, she's independent, she's smart, she's brave. Um, we just love her, we just love her anyway. Um, and then, um, unfortunately, one of her presents uh, is not gonna arrive until Monday, so she won't have it here uh, for tomorrow, but it's okay. I, I got her a, uh, <laughs> she's so funny. She wanted a flat iron for her hair because the one that she had broke down and she also wants some running shoes, um, sneakers basically. So, but that is, that I'd rather that, you know, that she comes along uh, with me and then we'll get her, I'll get her some. And of course, grandma wants to get her some flowers. So, and my brother's coming over, my sister's coming over, her husband, so it's, it should be fun. Okay, what else? There's so much going on guys. In April, uh, the event that I might be uh, joining is Giddy Up with JTMJ Crafts, which is Jeremy. And uh, I got this beautiful horse. Um, I think it's got like a pink, pink hair, a little bit of pink hair or pink uh, scarf. I don't know what it is. But anyway, it's from Craftably. So I'm looking forward to working on that. Um, yeah, and there, I mean, there's other events. I think there's another one on autism. So I need to find out um, a little bit about that. You know, what it what it it, it, it entails. So, um, you know, I don't want to say that I'm going to do it and then I can't do it. So I've got to check it out. And what else? Oh, looking forward to this week. I'm going out to lunch with my buddy Dorothy and Farah and Sarah and Gail. I'm not sure if Gail's coming along and then... There's another Sylvia. Yeah, there's another Sylvia. So I don't know if she's coming along. And so I'm looking forward to that. And I was thinking, you know, guys, it's been a while. I haven't had a scrap attack. I have to have my friends come over so we can get to do some scrapbooking, um, you know, and just laugh and chat and eat, of course. My favorite thing to do is eat, guys. Um, and then, of course, I think I'm going to have a diamond attack. So maybe invite a couple of uh, ladies that I have met um, uh, to come over and diamond paint. So I'll probably invite Holly and Shay and Randy. Yeah. yeah what else? Do, 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 do. Oh, and I'm still working, guys. I'm still making. I um, I don't know if you guys are aware. I need coasters. Um, <clears throat> So I don't know, people tell me that I should sell them, but I don't know if I should. I have a whole bunch of them. I make um, <clears throat> anything that you like. I, I just basically use scrapbooking paper. Um, I've made a couple with Alice in Wonderland, um, with gnomes, uh, doggies, you know, for people that have dogs, cats, um, anything. So I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I sell them? I don't know, it's something to think about. Mm, like I don't have enough things to do right <laughs> yeah but it's good to, to keep busy you know um, what else oh well this Wednesday 
I actually have to take my mom. She's got a, <clears throat> a heart appointment on, on Wednesday. So I got to do that. Um, what else? Do, 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 do. And like I mentioned before, I wish I could diamond paint it every day, but it's just impossible. Um, just too much going on. Um, oh, and in my last video, guys, um, was the, which was the unboxing of the siren, I um, like to apologize because I made a, a boo boo. I actually said that the 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 painting was double adhesive. Not, it is not. Um, it's poured glue. I don't know. You know, does this happen to you? I don't know. This happens to me all the time. It's like I'm thinking, I'm thinking of something, and but then something else comes out of my mouth. It's weird. Um, I mean, obviously, I'm getting older, and I just can't remember anything. So, and then. <laughs> The funny thing is when I'm diamond painting, I get beads, like I'll, I think I'm, and I'm finished and I get up and then I'll go to the kitchen and, then, and I've got like a row of beads stuck to the, the back of my arm. <laughs> so um, it, it, the same thing happens when I scrap, but um, instead of beads, it's paper or glue, you know, or paint. Yeah, yeah. that's what happens when you're, uh, you know, when you do arts and crafts, you know, but that's life. Anyway, so uh, what else? Anyway, I think I might just um, probably, I don't know. I'm trying to think what else is going on in the month of March. I don't know. I'm thinking maybe I would like to, uh, in the summer, um, Obviously, I would love to go to another retreat. There's one going on in on June, a diamond painting retreat. But um, I'm not sure if I'm on the list, but it's probably a very long list. And then there's another one going on in October. And um, that one, I am on the list. But like I mentioned, it's probably a very long list. Um, so I don't know. I think, I think that one, the one in October, is uh, a misery. And then the one in... June. I'm not sure if it's in Ohio. I can't remember. But anyway, um, what else? In diamond painting, guys, everyone should really try it. It's it's very relaxing. Um, uh, it's just relaxing and calming. Uh, I need that. Believe me, I get a little crazy sometimes, but that's life. Uh, what else? And I've met. Uh, I have to say I have met a lot of wonderful people um, that also diamond paint and, um, and if you need like any advice or you know you could contact them and they will help you um, Tina from um, uh, DP with Sparkler she's awesome guys um, <clears throat> you can call her and or you can not call her you can you know uh, contact her uh, Facebook or Instagram and um, you know she'll help you out and also uh, uh, I want to mention um, uh, Vivian from uh, oh gosh I'm telling you this is this is where I forget things oh my god what is it called Diamonds Around You thank you Diamonds Around You and she's awesome too she also help has helped me um, uh, what else who else and of course my buddy Rachel <laughs> Um, Nurse Rachel, um, I love her, and who else? Been um, crafting with Susie, uh, Cara, uh, of course, Shay, Randy, everybody, everybody's just awesome guys. Um, so anyway, anyway, so I'm looking forward to working on the siren. Um, I thought she was going to be a little smaller, but she's a little big. <laughs> I have to admit, she's, I don't know, for me, she's a little big. Um, but the tail, she's, it's, it's going to look spectacular. Um, and her hair, and that water, the way it reflects those colors. So, I don't know. May, I was thinking of actually maybe adding some ABs there too in the water, but I don't want to go crazy, you know, AB crazy. But I am going crazy with the, um, I'm out of control, guys, with the spending. I need to control that with buying diamond paintings and um, diamond pens, cover minders. What else? 
Um, what else did I do? Did I buy? Oh my gosh. Oh, of course. <laughs> Drills. I mean, it, you know, it's once you start buying those crystals and those sparklers, it's like you can't stop. They're just beautiful. Well, anyway, here I am. I'm finished. And, um, and now let's just move all this trash out of the way. Um, put it in the garbage. Make a mess in my table. Okay, and let's put the scissor aside. And now here it is. Everything is finished. I'm going to cut this out, this piece out, because we don't need it. And that way it will fit. The picture will fit in my container. Okay, that way I know that I'm working. This, th These are for the siren. Okay, and then of course I'm going to put my Munamay tray in there. And a, let's see which one, which one. This one, I think this one will go with the water because I've been painting. And maybe this one. And I think that's it. And then you close it up and it's ready. And that's it. Thank you very much, guys. Bye bye.